back when the concept of an urban multi-use transportation corridor was still an abstract idea, before the Atlanta Beltline became a must-do in the city, there was this question, how do you encourage people to explore these unpaved trails? The idea that stuck was to use public art to spark curiosity and invite people to discover more of these trails. Imagine, you're walking along an urban trail and you see this mural that stirs wonder inside you. You look down the trail and see another art installation and you want to check that out too. You walk a little further and a little further until you say, hey now, this place is pretty sweet. I think I wanna come back for my workout, commute, leisure time, and so on. That is how art on the Atlanta Beltline came to be. It is meant to encourage people to discover the Beltline while also supporting arts and culture. Since 2010, this annual exhibition has curated, hosted, or commissioned hundreds of works from local, national, and international artists. It has grown into the largest outdoor temporary public art exhibition in the South. Art on the Atlanta Beltline strives to make art accessible to all. It brings the gallery and museum to the people, and everything is always free. Spanning nearly 13 miles of permanent or unpaved trail, it features a year-round public art collection as well as temporary exhibitions. In addition to the exhibitions, the arts and culture team engages neighbors in thoughtful expression through family paint days, creative partnerships, and new opportunities to allow everyone to benefit from and enjoy the vibrant riches of Atlanta's diverse arts community. The Atlanta Beltline seeks equity and inclusion across all programmatic elements, including public art. Art on the Atlanta Beltline is committed to paying artists a living wage for their work and to providing arts and culture jobs in the local economy and beyond. Each spring, the exhibition opens a call for artists for its next season of temporary art. This could be for muralists, sculptures, musicians, dancers, anything creative. The vetting process for the exhibition is not taken lightly. All proposals go through a review panel composed of experts and the Beltline Public Art Advisory Council before a final review by ABI's executive leadership team. In essence, the exhibition aims to showcase the highest standard of public art that will inspire the community in new ways, reflecting the culture and history of Beltline neighborhoods or elevating voices that have been historically marginalized. Most art on the corridor is temporary. That's just the nature and beauty of public art. The annual art on the Atlanta Beltline exhibition includes Beltline walls, which involves the murals, Beltline spaces for sculptures and art installations, Beltline flow for the performing arts, there's also Beltline After Dark, a fabulous fest on the West Side Trail, the beloved Atlanta Beltline Lantern Parade, which attracts more than 70,000 participants and spectators, plus numerous special exhibitions and performances from our creative partners that take place in parks and pop up along the trail. But some work stick around a little longer in our continuing collection or as site-specific commissions in our foundational collection. What was once an invitation to explore has now become an invitation to connect to art and to each other. So come and check out what's new the next time you're out on the Atlanta Beltline.